But yeah, what I want to do now for the first hour, I wasn't able to walk instead I'm going to do some programming that I was going to do later and then walk later if the weather's better. Productive hour, getting some admin bits done. Don't really enjoy that stuff. Got to be done though. Now heading to the gym. Warm up is a walk to the car. I have to park bloody miles away living down here. So probably gonna get rid of my car because it's easier just to get about on foot when you live down South Sea. But yeah, come on with me. So we're gonna film the session. I'll see you in the gym. while we're here it's easy to fall off track these help us remember these battle scars don't look like the fate don't look like they're ever gone away they ain't never gonna change these battles growing up I had a dream something no one else could see tell me what it means when your faith is falling beneath your knees and you can't breathe everything you see reminds you of what you're not or something you won't be you gotta take what you're given that's how we live it don't be mad at the system it's simply how we've existed i hear a lot of people talking like they politicians and choose to be an accountant because it's safe in the business not because they want to do it just because they heard it pays and who's to be poor no one that's how we've been raised society is getting heavy i can feel the Right, we're going to do a chin up, 5 reps, barbell curl, 10 reps, and then a cable curl for 15 reps. Feel like the only way I'll be happy is getting signed to a label and making money through rapping. I wanna share my emotion because this world is attacking the very principle of life that lets the people be happy. If you don't have a reason to breathe, why even live? These battles cause our impressions of everything that it is. Conditioning, I'm going to show you. Can you see that? I had some massage work the other day, and my hamstrings are still broken from the three peaks. And I had like this suction thing done. Can you see that on the camera? Yeah, on it. So then my hamstrings are a bit sore, so we're resting our legs this week, but back to conditioning next week. So, gym done, showered up, now ready for the day. Um, time management is something I've been working on massively recently, and so yeah, this is why I'll try and talk through it a little bit later on in the day. My calendar, etc. Whilst not walking and holding a big DSLR camera up, um, my big camera today because my little one's not working properly. Not ideal. Um, but yeah, basically worked my day around, knowing I want to do an hour of reading, no cross trophies at seven, so basically trained a bit earlier because I could have trained later and then gone to my first client from 8 a.m. Um, but yeah, this is how I'm working today and hour of reading now. People ask why I read all the time as well. Um, it normally makes me really creative, so that's what, and obviously it teaches me a lot. So I love to learn a lot, and it gives me a creative edge, and it helps me with my content creation and stuff, um, and it helps me add more value to people because I, I, I get to learn. So yeah, that's why I do it. But yeah, I'm gonna get a coffee, and I will show you the setup in a bit. I'm gonna have my smoothie, coffee, and an hour of reading. Commitment, that was. I've been without a car for a week now, so I've been cycling, walking, or running everywhere. And when Jack says you've got to be at the gym for half four in the morning, you get up and think. 
but my legs in pieces. I've just done a pool session and run home from the gym and my calves are in agony. In a way, it's kind of a good thing because I am training for a triathlon. Well, I'll say I'm training for a triathlon. I don't have a Scooby what I'm doing. I'm just running, cycling and swimming there. But cycling and swimming, I actually do enjoy. It's quite nice. Running. Running. The shake has done I was making earlier. So I bring it with me, 25 grams of protein, 25 vitamins and minerals, taste bag in. I've got mint chocolate today, I think, is that what I made earlier? And coffee, and this book, by the way, is amazing. Well worth a good read. Jack's just sent me this as well. Decent. So now I've got to go and find a new piece of music, but just to cover my own back. That, look at that. That says copyright free, virtual riot. Turns out, ain't copyright free, damn it. Productive hour in Costa, chapter read, social media strategy for the day sorted, and now back to work for clients. These are some of the vitamins that I take just because I don't get enough in my diet at the moment, just because I'm lazy and sometimes slap on the old fruit and vegetables. And uh, this is what happened last night. Going in the gob. Whoa. Yeah, what I like to do is set myself a challenge. Guys, all as many tablets as possible in one sitting. Uh, my record is four. So at the moment we've got some vitamin and mineral complex, some fiber and herb, some omega-3, which is this one. And I also take creatine as well, which is the big white horse tranquilizer looking tablets. You're meant to take five a day of them and they make them this size. Oi, challenge. Day one on the vlog. Let's do this. What? Well, I'll wear my gold. And pot. More pot. I know that you like to snack. Top tip for you. Don't buy it in the first place. My mum, she bought these. 73 calories. They're not too bad. You get like six in a packet. They're, they're really good on calories until you have all six in one day because they're so nice. So we're just going to stick to the oats. Yeah, we've got 60 grams of oats. Two scoops of that and two scoops of that as well. There is the finished product. So apple, cinnamon, oats uh, and a banana all mixed with water. Uh, popped it into my fitness pal. 414 calories, 30 grams of protein. Banging as well, really good. If you want to see what I'm working on as well at the moment, so I'm editing a video for Jack. I'll show you a sneak peek of the, uh, the end shoulder workout, which was pretty ruthless. <laughs> It is 2 p.m. now. We've just got home. I've had a shower, washed the hair out of my luggles, and um. Not bad views today, lovely day on the south coast. I'm gonna make something to eat. I'm gonna have my second smoothie of the day because I have two a day. Um, also gonna have some of my oat apple and fiber, which is one of my favorite supplements um, from Herbalife. So I'm gonna smash that in, as well as my multivitamin that I have every day, and my fiber and herb. And we're gonna have some oats, some porridge oats, and I think we're gonna have some grenade white chocolate carb killer on top. I'm gonna show you what we come up with. Callum, if you're watching this, mate, you're going to have to fast forward it, bud. So the protocol for the smoothie is always five or six ice cubes in the blender with 250 to 300 milliliters of water. Now, 
This is the oat apple and fibre supplement that gets a lot of good reviews and it's for good reasons really. So I didn't believe it. I was just like, nah, I'm not having it. Not can't be that good. And so I tried it. And I've had bad guts. Not bad guts, but I've always had bloating or bad belly from the minute I left the womb, I reckon. So I used to think it was just a normality thing. Been using this bad boy for six weeks. No more problems. No bloating. Generally feel a lot better. So definitely recommend it. That goes in there. We're gonna mix it with, with water and smash that down. So just having that and the smoothie, there's a lot of water, so it generally fills me up quite a lot. Um, I'm gonna have that. I'm also gonna have some porridge, which I've changed the way I make as well. So I'm gonna show you that. It takes a bit longer now, but it fills me up a lot more. I'll have this and then probably see me through till dinner tonight at like seven, when Robin gets home. She's gonna make something nice better. 80 grams of oats in the saucepan. And then we're gonna go 600 ml of water. That'll sit on there, come to boil, a couple of minutes, maybe a bit longer. Then I'm gonna add in this little monkey. This little monkey. So basically what I'm gonna do now is watch the videos that Callan's prepared for me today whilst I eat my oats. And yeah, get them posted. One of these videos just isn't working. I've got most of them done, but one of them just not working. It's really frustrating. So, got myself a diet Pepsi, so I'm stressed. Big, big dent in the to-do list, so let's try and get a better light. I'm gonna go for a walk out there because looking at it for the last few hours has made you want to go for a walk and the essential bits are done from the to-do list so I'm gonna go for some steps stick these bad boys in my lug holes listen to an audiobook currently we're about to finish Gary B's crushing it we'll finish that on this walk now to be fair and then get back for some dinner and I'll record what we're having so yeah get some steps and already on 10,000 for the day could be a big one Inside of the wind, that Pepsi made all these things that are easy to do and not to do. And I'll always do them. My alarm's set for 4 a.m. I'm always going to get up. I've got to do What kind of bars is that? Jack, there's flowers in your one. Ghost bar flowers, put in a... That's, that's how I measure me oats, mate. <laughs> We're filming an episode of the podcast, number 21. What time is it? Quarter past eight. What time have we got this morning? Four o'clock. We love it. We are all set up. Robin's gone for a nervous wee, and I'm gonna make this as awkward as I possibly can for her. <laughs> we fucking smashed it, mate. <laughs> Five past nine, and I fancy an Easter egg, fuck it. Here we go. <laughs> oh, that or Oreo. Oh, actually. Oh, Jesus. Christ on a motorbike. That's going in me. <laughs> Be more. <laughs> Look at her face. Why are you Jack, I can't eat that. Why not? Because of Jamaica. I'm not going to Jamaica. And I've trained, I'm actually going three for next week. But I've trained hard all week and we've done really well then, so I'm going to have a bit of chocolate. See you tomorrow, uh, podcast, a vlog. Thanks for watching.